um, oops, <laughs> long sheet the wine glasses there. I don't know, this is a really good picture for me, I don't think so. I just got through sunbathing, it's about 5.50 p.m. Oops. Um, anyway, my hair, I had to put my hair up because if I don't put my hair up, then, I don't know, let's see. if I don't put my hair up, then, um, um, but, you know, it's all over the place. So I just got through some bathing. Um, you remember that place on my neck I was telling you about? Um, well, it was a month. Uh, let's see. I, it could be the, oh, well. Anyway, it could be the, um, polysanto oil with the Anu. The Anu, um, water, um, liquid is a liquid that, um, I got from more herbs and it's, it um, helps cleanse your body from um, your blood from metals, um, remove metals, fluoride, and other um, harsh elements that should not be in your blood system. So um, I just start taking that. And also the Palo Santo oil, I've been um, putting that inside our coffee, our tea, and um, turmeric tea, and so forth. But I want you to, um, okay, so this is, this is I, ne I never really get eczema on this side. I never get it but this side right here um this is where I got it and I'm telling you um shoot the way by today it has really cleared up really good in like a week um also I've been implementing um inside the turmeric tea with moringa powder and uh, mushrooms lime so um Imani and I we squeeze lime and we boil the tea then I also use um um lemon i eat the whole lemon um like i cut a piece off the lemon like a half a piece and i drink my alkaline water a lot of times i get alkaline water from whole foods to um it's a bottle of water so i can carry i haven't brought there's another i can get another uh, alkaline container that alkalines your water but i haven't gotten it yet uh, that you can carry with you so i um, get the water from um whole foods it has electrolytes and i think it's 99.9 percent .9 alkalinity Anyway, I eat the lemon usually when I walk to go earn money at Burger King and drink the water. And I, the eczema is like really, really clearing up fast. I am so, so thankful and grateful for the thoughts of just saying, okay, let me purchase this or um, let me implement this, um, this, this herbal remedy or these natural remedies. I am so thankful. Also, um, we just, we just, okay, I purchased, um, blood and lymph, um, cleanser from more herbs and, um, blood and lymph cleanser. And what else did we purchase? Just came in money, blood and lymph and something else. Uh, he's, uh, oh, anti, um, biotic, full uh, antibiotic. So, yeah. Um, this is blood and lymph. Okay, I got those. Um, this just came like day for yesterday. Oh, lung and respiratory. Lung and respiratory. Um, but I just got started doing the, those to you know because they just came like what day before yesterday. So um, I am just really, really feeling really thankful and grateful. Uh, so once again, I just got through some bathing, feeling pretty okay. Um, uh, still working on <laughs> but I'm feeling really well and um anyway I just want to take Islam I'm gonna I'm gonna email you um in another video and I am doing a prayer about um I saw a video or a um, tweet of, of Aya Aya Eme Oma I think I said her name right anyway Eme or not anyway about whether a person or whether they should be in your life or not you pray for it and the ancestors or the elements i think i call elements as well which are um, i think the ancestors speak through the, the elements and um because ancient our ancient ancestors were more were at one with the elements um ancient 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 ancestors i'm not talking about a thousand years I'm I'm talking way 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 long ago, so um, um so that means winds, fire, earth, so um, water, 
So, um, about being in someone else, someone's life. Are, are we supposed to be in someone's life? And so I am um, demonstrating that prayer. Um, I am going to pray. And uh, she said, the ancestors will answer you in one business day. So if you are praying that to see truth, I'll pray that with you. I'm not afraid. You can't be afraid of truth. You know, you just can't. And if you, I, I mean, I think spirits of truth will always, always prevail. So, um, and when you stand in the spirit of truth, when you stand in and breathe spirit of truth, that which you desired, you realize what's a falsity. And then that spirit of truth of what is really meant supposed meant to happen, supposed to be for you, would be what you what you will then have in favor and with the spiritual eye you recognize the favor and you realize that it was that you are in truth and you you are thankful and grateful. So when we pray this together, we are asking for truth of that which we desire that maybe be falsity, whatever it is, we release. And if that means um, releasing someone from your life, then you have to do it. Islam. Because we don't live just for this lifetime. We are reincarnated and we come back and we come back and we come back and we build and we build and we build. That's how it's, I believe that's how we're supposed to do. And we're, we're supposed to build, build and build Islam. That's what, that's my belief. That's what, that's what my spirit tells me. It's more than a belief. My spirit tells me this is it. That's the fruition. But it, now the complexity of that fruition is still, unco I'm still uncover uncovering it. But that's the fruition that my 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 Arcacia records are telling me, Islam. I want to send this to you quickly, so let me let you go. I'm going to upload it. Islam, it's about 5.55 p.m.